Yo, what's going on, Sexy Salmon Letter Squad? I know, I know. I've been gone for a while. I got a couple things, though. So, obviously, I set up my entire... My, my back. I don't have anything for these shelves yet, but... I set up the back. Um, got my Hollow Knight poster and my, uh, my Avatar poster. You can't really see that one that well, but... Got an Avatar poster. And the most important thing, the biggest reason why I've been gone for four to five days is a new member of this family. No, it's not a baby. <laughs> well, okay, it's a baby, but it's a puppy. Um, we got a new puppy. He's eight weeks old. We got him on his eight-week birthday. So as soon as possible is when we went and we got him. He is two pounds and eight ounces. He's the smallest little thing. He's a little white uh, Bichon, purebred Bichon, and he's absolutely adorable, and he needs all the attention in the entire universe. If, if you don't pay attention to him, for one second he starts crying. I mean, he's an infant after all. He's eight weeks old. He just got away from his mom, so, you know, it, obviously, obviously he needs a little bit extra attention. Um... And I know what you're saying, Sam, show me him. I will. He'll be making an appearance during the video. I'll, I'll pause for a minute. I'll full screen. I'll show you him. Don't worry. He's with his mom right now. Um, and yeah, he's, he's absolutely adorable. And I haven't been able to sleep because, like I said, he's an infant. So he wakes up every hour and cries. Um... But we have family over right now, and they he slept with them last night, and we actually got a lot of sleep, and now I'm like, okay, I can work, dude. I can work. So yeah. You guys will see him though, don't worry. He, he's lifted my mood so much because uh, me and me and Shiv have been talking about getting a puppy but what we didn't we weren't going to get one until the end of the year but we walked into a pet store and he was there in the first window he's bullied by his brothers and sisters so he was in a window all of his own he was all by himself because like I said his brothers and sisters bullied him and so he had to be he had to be put in, in his own little thing and he is so timid and he is so cute and so soft, like soft hearted. He just loves to cuddle and like be next to people. And it's honestly amazing. And we saw him and we wanted a poodle breed also because they're really smart and you know, they're just easy to train and stuff. Like, let me put it this way. He's eight weeks old, right? He has gone. He's been with us for for three days now. Today's the third day. He's gone to the bathroom in the house once. And he's eight weeks old. Like, how is an eight-week-old potty trained already? It's, in, it's insane. So, yeah, he, he's really smart. He's really great. And, um... Like I said, we weren't going to get a puppy. But we walked into the, into the store and we were like, Oh my god. This, this is our dog, dude. He wa we walked up to the window, and we saw we saw other people walk up to the window too, and he didn't do anything. He just laid there. But we walked up to the window, and with his his tiny ass self, he like put his he put his front two paws on the glass and looked at us, and started wagging his tail. And we were like, "Well, he's ours now." <laughs> yeah, and then the past couple days we've been making trips around to my family. Chilling off our new baby. <laughs> Yo, why is these things so tanky, bro? Oh my. I don't really have enough mana to kill the wave and to kill him. So I'm gonna save my one and I'm just gonna auto the wave. Nice. Good kill. 
by the way, this is going to be an hour long video. I don't know if I said that. Um, it's going to be an hour long video to, I guess it's my way of apologizing for the past four days of not uploading or streaming or like literally doing anything. I kind of just fell off the face of the earth for four days, which I know in my profession is like super bad. Because <laughs> when you fall off the face of the earth for four days in my profession, you're basically gone for a month and a half and everyone has already forgotten your name. So, but it's okay. It's okay. We'll rebuild. By the way, I wanted to say thank you guys for, um, like I said, I haven't uploaded in three or four days and it hasn't changed really the YouTube at all. I mean, sure, the, the sub count went lower because, I mean, I wasn't here obviously, right? So why, why would the subs go up? But, um, you guys still got like 50,000 views a day on the channel, so thank you guys so much, y'all. Really awesome, man. Really awesome community. But it's okay, I'm back. I'll be recording every day. I might not be streaming every day because like I said, I got family over, but you can assume um, that I'm streaming. And if I'm not streaming, then I'll tweet out that I'm not streaming. So follow my Twitter, follow my Twitch, and be on the lookout for notifications. Where you going? I know you ain't doing my minis. I know you ain't doing mine. I know you didn't just steal one of my minis. I damn well know you did not just steal one of my minis. You better alt, gangster. Get this wave. He did finish his golden blade now, but like, I got so much gold, and I have finished Heke. Like that, that item is so not okay. Or Hakati, Hakate, Hakata. I don't know how to say it, man. I will literally never know how to say it. I'm gonna go do Boldy Moon ever, by the way. Surprised he didn't have six. Genuinely. Is my. Is my mic picking up my my fan? I don't know. It doesn't seem like it. There was some sound in the background there. Maybe someone is yelling downstairs. I can't hear them, but my mic can. My mic has always been really sensitive. I upped the noise gate on it um, when I moved into the house. And I also... Hold on. I also did this, so I have this big ass wall of soundproofing to help with the echo and whatever. Make sure it's right. You can barely see that avatar poster up top. I mean, he ages and I still almost killed him. He doesn't have boots, it's a big deal. Here I am. Are you coming this way? You are coming this way. Alright. He hit the one, but it wasn't enough to keep him alive. Fortunately for me and unfortunately for him. Um I don't know if I should do bold even yet. I mean he can't steal it, right? I might as well. It's almost impossible for him to steal Bull Demon. I need beads because you get stunned by an Arachne, you're big dead. You are so big dead. I'm still in Grandmasters, by the way. I have really low MMR. Um, granted, on purpose. Oh, my puppy! Here is here is Appa. This is his name, Appa. He's my, he's my little baby. He's my little purebred Bichon. 
Yeah, he did. Look at that wiggle. <laughs> but yeah, he's he's two pounds. He's eight weeks old. Oh yeah. Uh, they do get that. Yeah, yeah. Bijans get that little thing in their eyes. We're gonna shower him today because he needs it. Um, then we're gonna take him to the vet in a couple of days for more vaccines. But this is him. really small, and he loves to cuddle, and he loves being held. And all my viewer, viewer attention is gone now. That's how I, that's how you got him in, telling him I'm gonna show him a puppy. Now that they've seen the puppy, they're leaving. <laughs> Thank you, baby. Come back. Okay. We killed him. We, he's only dead for 10 seconds, so. Can't really do anything insane. Other than do Bull Demon. Oh, actually, I got some other pictures I can show you on... Uh, on Twitter. I can show you afterwards, after this game, while we're in queue. What are you doing? Leave me alone. I know you ain't landing back on here. All right, let's get this Phoenix, boys. I have no mana. <laughs> Look at that minion going over to the solo that Titan. Yo, talk about confidence. <laughs> Don't stun me, please. Okay. Good kill. I really don't have that much mana. It ain't GG yet, brother. I don't do that much damage. I only have three items. Don't early GG me, because then I look like an idiot when I don't actually win the game. Now you can GG. I think. Hopefully. Am I still bad? Hold on. No, definitely GG now. Alright. I got a cut on my thumb. That's really annoying me. I was playing with it that entire game and I... Super annoying. Yo, have you guys gone to... um? to what is it costco and gotten these little sparkling waters they're sweet and they, they're almost like a soda right look how bad my mmr is but i'm still in gm um they're like they're sparkling waters but they they taste straight up like soda but there's no aspartame or anything you know that thing that everyone thinks gives cancer um and it's actual water. It's literally like the number one ingredient is carbonated water. I guess you can't see it, but. So it's hydrating. And it tastes good. And it doesn't give you cancer, to my knowledge. So. All in all, it's like, it's really good. This flavor sucks. I wouldn't, don't ever drink the orange because it tastes like medicine. Um, but the purple one and the green one are amazing. Let's play duel, I said. It'll be fun, I said. Get slapped by Sam. Hey, man. Some people... Some people... Pay for that kind of treatment. Oh, he's already gone. Okay, let me open up my Twitter. You guys little pictures of my... Of my other beeb. My secondary beeb. That's him running towards the camera. That's a good picture. You do. So cute. So cute. All right, let me. Uh, oh, monitor capture's already off. Nice. I'm so cool. I'm so cute. Yo, chat. Are there any chances if you're watching this? We're only 15 minutes in. Hopefully, you're still watching. Um, actually, I'll say it when I'm not 
or when I'm out of queue, because a lot of people don't watch during the queue. So, I guess we wait. Hey, what's up, sexy Samalander squad? Thanks for skipping the queue. Welcome back to the Picks and Band phase. Um, no, but seriously, though, uh, I forgot what I was going to say, actually. Oh, I was going to say, if you're not subscribed and you do watch the content and love the content, please consider subscribing because there is an analytic here that I might be able to show you real quick if I got I to gotta pull it up. A lot of people that watch my channel are not subscribed. And if they did subscribe, we'd be the number one subscribed Smite channel on YouTube, period. Period. That would be insane. Like genuinely incredible. Hold on. Go into subs. Learn more. Let's ban... Or who are we playing, though? Question. I actually have a pretty good amount of people subbed, to be honest. Oh, well, I guess that was last month. What about Lifetime? Yeah, I mean, I have a pretty good amount of people subbed. Right here, you can see. Um... About 40.3% are not subscribed though. So if you are part of the 40%, please consider subscribing. It would make my day. And you know, subscribing helps get the name out there more, which brings in more content, um, which gives me more ideas for better content, which just skyrockets the whole channel even further and further. So if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. It would um, it would be amazing. It would be amazing. And I thank you in advance for it. I'm fighting Professor Rat, which I'm pretty sure... Um, has more stars than I've ever counted in my life. I wonder what acorn he, he goes. What acorn do you buy? Professor Rat is currently offline. Oh, it's got one... Wait. Oh god, I can't spell. What acorn do you normally buy? Okay. I should have gone mana pots if I'm going to go speed buff, but... Okay. What is Thistle Thorn? Is that the HP one, or... Is that a different one? Um, Thistle DHP one? I don't know which one that is. That's evergreen. Okay, well, I guess I'll figure out it eventually. A monument to my opulence. Is it the crit one? Oh, why? I thought I feel like the five acorn one is kind of a trap, to be honest. It's easier to hit your stun, but you don't need that the five acorns if you're just good at hitting your stun in general. You know? Like, like right there, he hit his stun. Wouldn't it have benefited him more to get like a lot of HP from that stun or something else? It's the best for duel. Right. Fair enough. I mean, I'm not gonna argue with the dude that has 75 stars on it on Rat. just give up all this XP. Yo, for real? He backed? Oh, no, he didn't back. Oh god, I suck. Okay. He could totally kill me if he ulted, by the way. But I guess he doesn't have mana, so never mind. I think evergreen is so much better in duel because 
Um, the reason I think Evergreen is so much better is because the only way you can win a game as Rat in duel, you'll never win by going full damage. The only way you'll win is by uh, by going like a tank build, pretty much. Like two or three defensive items, two or three um, like hybrid items, you know? And the uh, sorry, I, I had to focus on not losing that buff. I would have been real upset. And the only reason that I think Evergreen is better is because when you're going that tank build, you have like 3k HP. I mean, I just I literally just made a video about it. Damn, I suck. Oh, I think he's... I wonder if he just gets his tube strictly for the clear help. That could be it. I mean, it's not a bad idea. It does clear really well. But if you're going for the help for the clear, wouldn't you want to get that other one that lets you use your two twice? And it makes you stack protections more, right? I could be wrong though. Again, I don't really know anything about rats, so maybe I should just stop talking about the acorn subject, but it's also the only thing on my mind right now, and it's the only thing I can fill the air with. So welcome to YouTube. <laughs> I'm not I'm not the brightest individual. In fact, I quit college my senior year in order to pursue YouTube, if that says anything about my intelligence level. I suck. Oh, I'm amazing. Never mind. Holy crap. I'm literally the best gamer. Ooh, that would have killed. If I hit that, he would have been dead. Hit that, he would have been so dead. Please tell me my two clears. If it doesn't, I'm going to be super upset. Oh, nice. Nice. Just pop all our potions and heal. Go Hydra's next. Ooh, that, that baby is going to hurt. Nice. Well played, well played. Very predictable that he was going to go in on that because of the fact that, um... Oh, he just backed, so he spent all his gold, which means... You're lucky I haven't played in two weeks? I haven't played in a week. This is my second game back in 20 minutes. Um... But anyways, I knew he was gonna he was gonna dash in and uh, and go for the stun, so I just jumped. Got the kill. Easily, easily. Oh man, that would have been so sick. I know he's over here. A monument, my opulence. Did he back or? I guess he backed. I don't see him anywhere. <laughs> Damn it, I really thought he was gonna. Oh, that stunt. Nice. 
Alright. Alright, I could see it. I could see it off off that play, I could definitely see why he thinks the Soul Thorn is good. Because you can stun at any distance, and that's a big deal. I originally didn't think that would matter at all. But it lets you get the stun off and then dash in, which is big. Like it gives that threat that he's gonna stun that might need to use their escape, and then you can dash in after they use their escape. So I could see it. I could see it. I still think Evergreen is better, don't get me wrong. But it makes sense the way he played that. It would be super beneficial if I like literally hit anything ever. I had ult, he was so dead, dude. Oh, red's up, actually. I don't care that much anymore. Do I get tower off that because of my minions? Oh, so close. So close. Got thorns. I can put some respect on that thorns. Can I be honest, buddy? I really think this is not the play. Booey. <laughs> Alright, tower down. Let's go back. Get the cooldown. Actually, because he has Hydras, I think I'm gonna go hide. Maybe I shouldn't be taking be talking randomly in the middle of a fight. What? What do you mean talking randomly? Oh, did, did he taunt or something? Is that what he's talking about? I don't know. Oh. <laughs> okay. I threw my nuts too far to the left. I do that shit in bed way too often. <laughs> yeah, I think Hydra is the better play here. To cancel out those Hydra's autos, that's a big deal. Actually a big deal. Now don't get me wrong, Breastplay would be super good too, but... Yo, I wish hitting stuff wasn't so difficult for me, you know? You know, you gotta respect the guy. What? I love Yogg's- who? Wait. Oh. <laughs> oh god, he has his ult up, dude. Oh god, help me. I wanted him to land there because I knew I could get away, by the way. If he stunned instead of dashed, I would have beads and jumped. But he dashed instead of stunned, so I didn't. I even got to save my beads, man. Good stuff. And if I turned to fight, he would have popped thorns, and I would have been so dead, so... Running was the best option there. Because I was thinking about... Beadsing his ult, like when he landed on me, beadsing that, and then just, um, stunning him to the wall when he lands, since I won't be knocked up. 
and then ulting him. But he would have just popped thorns and I would have died. And then I would have looked like a fool. Alright. GG gamer. Let's take a sip of this. I'm really thirsty. This tastes like medicine, but like whatever, I'm thirsty. Yeah, it definitely tastes like medicine. Orange and mango, they just don't mix. In water flavor. Damn it, long Q, man. Long Q. What do we talk about? How do I how do I record? Um, go to Twitter. Let's see what's going on on Twitter here. Oh, you know what? Actually, let's just look at pictures of my puppy. Oh, wait. Did you guys see this? I posted this picture out of uh, Tsukuyumi. And, uh, yeah. <clears throat> that's his three. And that's 32,358 damage with 15,459 damage mitigated. B BMT said, now you're thinking with mayonnaise. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god. See, here's the deal, right? I just don't know what to talk about. Mm. Damn, for real? Damn, dude. Yo. The, uh... The Olympians are kind of... Well, at least one of the Olympians. Kind of, kind of toxic, bro. Kind of toxic, bro. Yo, I'm gonna smite chair that says my name. Maybe I can hold on. I'm gonna message. I'm gonna message the vice president of the company and ask if I can. Hey, how much do I have to pay you to get one of those company smite chairs? with my name on it instead because that'd be kind of cool and also kind of funny and also um thanks in advance because you're going to say yes perfect that's how you get them that's how you get them um, I guess I should go back to YouTube, check on YouTube analytics, see what's going on there. I wonder, hold on, let's look up some YouTubers that have a lot of subs that play Smite that are like my competition, I guess. Uh, like Weekin? Jesus Christ, Weekin has 174k subs? My God. What about Incon? He kind of has 141k. <clears throat> um, Solo Double J. That's not how you spell his name. Came up and he's at 140k. Not bad. Oh, but he's, he doesn't only play... He doesn't play Smite anymore on his YouTube, does he? No, he still does. Two days ago. I thought he... I thought he dropped it, but I think he's he's just mixing in other stuff. Good for him, dude. I'm really I'm really happy of him. Lexi, 127. Everyone's bigger than me, huh? I'm a tiny ass boy. I mean, I guess I said everyone. That's four people. It's literally I was still in the top five. So, I mean, unless you want to count Warchi, Warchi War. He has 203k. He's the number one. But he doesn't speak English, so he's not my competition. 
He's in like his own little vector, I guess. Um. I mean, those are like the big boys that I think of, right? Like, unless um, Final Case has gone up a lot. I mean, it has gone up a lot. He's at 55. Panda Cat. He's at 12.9. By the way, I recommend you subscribe to literally everybody. Because it helps all of us out. But especially subscribe to me because I want to be number one. Um... Mast, he hasn't uploaded in like forever though, right? Five months is his last upload. He's at 94k though. That's kind of crazy. Um, what happens if I just type in smite? Obviously the smite channel. Intersect is at 78k. Oh no, that's, no, he's at 67k. Uh... Scrolling, fine, okay. Yeah, so it's like, we're the top five, man. Yo, top five Smite YouTuber, like subscribe-wise. That's nuts. And one of the top viewer-wise, just like straight up, just one of the top, like top two viewer-wise. Again, unless you count Warchi. But like I said, he's not really like... He doesn't speak English. He's not really my competition. Uh, who am I playing? Let's play Mercury. I've played a Merc game in a while. That's not a good matchup. I hate that. Actually, it is a good matchup. Because if he alts, I press 2. Like, his alt cripples me. Uh, but I just pressed a balls, a ball sack Vic, huh? Grandmaster's Conquest player? Ball sack Vic. What a name, dude. What a name. <laughs> I feel like I feel like I gotta message him. I gotta tell him his name is sick. Thank you very much. <laughs> I do my best. Your best is Sick. Alright. I backed because I want the extra movement speed from extra damage on my first punch on the buff. He's got his stun ready, dude. Hmm. Should I be scared of him right now? Oh, it did hit me. It didn't stun me, though. Oh, nice dash. That was a good dash. Alright, I'm going to back out. Go get my golden blade. Alright, not a bad start, dude. Not a bad start. We got his bracer too, I believe. It's really good. I'm gonna back after this wave. I just want to get my mini. <clears throat> Not my mini, I'm sorry, my, my blue buff. And then I'm gonna back and hopefully alt red if I don't see him. Which would be wildly beneficial for me. He is going to red buff immediately, which is really good. Oh god, that hit me. 
Alright. You got the red, but... But I got the kill, so I'll take it. I don't like the fact that... I didn't get the, uh... The red buff, but... I got body blocked by, by the buff itself, actually. <laughs> which is why his ult blew me up. It's not a big deal, though. We'll grab some booties. You going for the wave or you going for the buff? Going for the wave first, alright. Because his clear is bad, I'm gonna get my speed and then go. I don't lose any XP. Good stuff. Because I have Golden Blade, I won't be able to get the, uh, the gold for that, which is fine. Ironic. Golden Blade and it loses me gold. Sick gamer moves, bro. Alright. Genuinely not scared right now. Oh, damn it. Alright. Alt for alt, I'll take it. Oh, he's got stun though. I could die here. Oh, I am dead here. There's no point in bracing that because, uh. I was dead no matter what there. He had full boots, I didn't have finished boots yet. That sucks. His cooldown on his one is actually faster than the cooldown on my my dash, which I guess shouldn't surprise me, but it did. <laughs> it's okay. One to one. He's not ahead at all, I don't think. At least he shouldn't be. I gotta make sure I can get this red, though. I gotta be able to take this red from him. I don't have my two up, so I cannot alt him here. Oh, he got the buff. Nice. I had to juke like that because if I didn't juke like that, he was... I could tell by the way he was playing, I could just tell that he was one auto off of getting his stun. Because if he was two or three autos off, he wouldn't have he wouldn't have held his one that long. He would have just used it. But the reason he was holding his one that long is because he was one auto off of getting the stun. So I just played around the fact that, you know, he needed one auto to get the stun and I just juked until... I was able to get close enough to get the 3 on him. And he got the red, but I got the kill again, so... XP wise, breaks even pretty much. Let's just keep pushing. He did his blue. Gonna do the minis. I stole his minis also. I should be ahead of X in... Or ahead in XP now. Yeah, I'm level 12, he's level 11, so we're chilling. Almost killed me. Almost killed me with that that all, dude. Holy crap. I think I want sprint. Beads would be helpful too, actually. I'm slow immune with my two. And as long as I play around my two, 
I should never get hit by his ult. So because of that, I'm just gonna grab beads for his one. I have counterplay to being stuck in his ult. I do not have counterplay to getting stunned. I need a Toxic Blade. You got defense, yeah. He wants to fight me. Oh, he didn't go for the next minion. Nice. Nice. He wanted to uh he wanted to fight that, but I had that beads online. I misplayed my two, but because he used his one and his his alt at the same time, I was able to I was able to beads it pretty much at the same time, so we got lucky in that regard, I suppose. I want to go Aaron die because I want to punch him in the head really hard. I also need defense at some point because you can't play Mercury without getting defense. But that being said, it can wait a little bit, I think. 900 gold, right? 1,000 for Aaron die. This up? Oh, it is up. Backing. Alright, let's do Bull Demon then. I normally don't do Bull Demon for tower, but... I felt like right here it was okay. Oh, okay. All down. Alright, he gets blue, but I got tower, and I got my Aaron die here too. Nice. Nice, alright, well played. Well played. He might get red as well, actually, which kind of sucks, but... Nothing I can really do about it. Never mind, he's not getting red. I'll be damned if I let you get red, bro. I'm so fast. Alright, he got my blue, but I got red buff. And I got his blue as well, and hopefully I can get his speed too. I gotta punch this guy once in the back. Now let's go get our breastplate so that I can alt more often and hence 
Erendite more often, which is a big, big deal. Bold Demon is going to come up soon, actually, and I'll have red buff when it spawns, so I might be able to just get it. Especially because he doesn't have ult, right? So... Yeah, that was coming. He's actually just giving me his Phoenix for real. That's a really bad idea, man. He's Cupid. I clear so much faster than him, it's insane. So trading Phoenixes here is actually so much more beneficial for me than it is for him. But I'll do it, dude. I'll do it, I don't care. It's so much more beneficial for me, are you serious? That was such a bad play. I'm I'm actually really happy he did that. I'm really lucky. Because now I just win the next fight. And then I win the game. Yeah, he's going to have a really hard time clearing fire minions. Unless he goes Oboe, which I guess he's building right now, but... Dude, really? Are you just gonna ignore me all game? You're just gonna act like I don't exist? I will literally win the game right now. Please! I'm a human! Play with me! Oh my god, he listened. Okay, well, he missed. Yep, knew that was happening. See you later, buddy. Actually, wait, I win the game if I just keep him here. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna go H of all. Oh, that's not how you spell it. Let's see. This will be the last game for sure. We're at almost 55 minutes. Boom, boom. Now, here's the question Do I just go get Bull Demon again? I think I do. I think I do just go get Bold Demon again. He wants to stop me. Phoenix then. Oh, my bad. Oh, the thorns, dude. The thorns got me there. He should be able to get Phoenix here. Should be able to. 
He's got 20 seconds to run there, and he has his three. Does he have Oboe yet? I didn't even pay attention. Oh, he's going Interval, not Oboe. Yeah, he'll be able to get there. With his thorns down, I should be able to just straight fight him, I think. I just box him. He dropped red. I don't want him to back. Oh, I fucking missed. Okay, I have Aaron died. He can't outrun me. Alright. GG. GG. Good game. Actually a well-played Cupid, too. I don't see many of those. GG Gamer. Alright. I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, this welcome back video. GG, you are very fast. <laughs> um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this this like welcome back video and my puppy. And yeah, thank you guys for subbing. Thank you for watching. If you did enjoy watching, please like, comment, and subscribe. Until next time, peace. How do I end my How do I end my recording? This button.